Sincerely, sometimes I'm not in the mood for love making. When I tell my husband I'm not in the mood, he feels offended. It shows in his actions the next day. He may not even initiate any discussions again until I do. The atmosphere in the house is so tensed. Just because I said I was not in the mood, sir, I must say I don't deprive him sex always. All I'm saying is that he should understand when I'm tired and not in the mood. <laughs> I feel irritated at the instance when I'm not in the mood and he's touching me. Mm -hmm. Sir, should I always be in the mood? <laughs> Shouldn't I be tired sometimes? <laughs> ah, you're welcome to the doctor's script. You're welcome to the doctor's script, aka Ratata family. All right, right here we discuss, we share, we help ourselves. All right, okay. So, the question is, uh, should I always be in the mood for love making? All right, so first thing first, what you must know is that in marriage, in marriage, sex is an obligation. Sex is not what you do when you want to do. No, it's an obligation because when you say yes, I do to him or her, both of you became one. Your body becomes his and his body becomes yours. So in marriage, there is nothing like I'm not in the mood, I'm tired. No, because in marriage, sex is an obligation that you owe God to give to your spouse. If your spouse wants it, then you must offer it to him or her as a sacrifice to God. If you see sex as something you owe God to give to each other, then you will respond in season and out of season. When it comes to marriage, I'm not in the mood does not apply. That is why you must marry someone that understands you, someone that have understanding, someone that knows when you are in the mood and when you are not, someone that will understand when you are not in the season. You see, <laughs> some of you that, that marry because of sex, huh, time, many, many times you will not be in the mood, you will be tired from work. Don't just marry for sex, marry someone with understanding. Someone that, that will not even disturb you once you are tired, he knows or she knows, alright? But don't do it as if it's your right that you do it only when you want. No. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Alright? So you have to sit down and discuss with your husband. Discuss with him. Let him understand that you are tired. Plead with him. Uh -huh. Because you, it's not what you will do because you want to. Or what you will do because you know no no there is no there is no mood or no mood there, there is no i'm not in the mood in marriage in marriage sex is an obligation i want that to enter you it's an obligation so discuss with your partner let there be understanding okay i love you don't forget to send in your questions to the doctor's crib all right send in your questions to my email you know just send your wherever you see my handle send your <laughs> questions there i will attend to them you know i love you yeah